Freedom and Northampton's top pitchers would go toe-to-toe in Thursday night's contest in North Bethlehem. Freedom's Alexis Acevedo and Northampton's Emma Fraley. Both pitchers win a groove through the first inning and a half with one runner on and two out sophomore Maya D'Amico would hit a single moving senior Madeline Cooper all the way over to third base, setting up an RBI situation for junior Madison Glick. Glick didn't waste the moment as she was able to hit a single scoring both Cooper and D'Amico to give Freedom a two to nothing lead. Fraley was able to settle in after the two run single as she was able to record back to back strikeouts of Acevedo and Cooper in the bottom of the fourth to keep the game at two to nothing. Acevedo was pulled in the top of the sixth with one out as freshman Brooke Rummel entered the game to pitch in relief. After recording the second out of the inning, she delivers a pitch to senior Nicole Yellen, who drives the pitch over the center field wall for a three-run home run and to give Northampton a 3-2 lead. The home run for Yellen was her second of the season. Northampton got another run in the sixth to take a 4-2 lead. Fraley then got senior Brianna Cole to pop up to freshman Avery Debert at first base to end the game and preserve the 4-2 win for the Concrete Kids. Northampton improves to 14-5 on the season. Freedom drops to 14-4. I mean, I think our lineup is very dependable and very strong. And I mean, proving that and being able to show other people that too feels pretty good, especially when we put up runs against a good team like that. Yeah, uh, we've had uh, a rough week against uh, Whitehall and Emmaus, and we knew that we had some great teams that we were going to face this week. And we knew coming in here that um, they were coached well. We knew that they were a good team. We knew that we had to perform. And you know, going down early, it was kind of tough, but it showed that they're willing to fight to like to the end, which, you know, it didn't go our way the last two big games that we had. So this was great for us to come back in this win. The Concrete Kids showed a lot of resiliency in their win over the Freedom Patriots. They, of course, had the timely hitting, which is necessary, but two keys that the Concrete Kids hope to take into the postseason are defense and energy. Yeah, I think we're just going to continue to focus on our defense and making adjustments at the plate. You know, I think that's what happened today. They they took the coaching and they took the adjustments that we were telling them to make and they did them. You know, sometimes it's hard to, you know, execute or ask a batter to do something that they're not comfortable with. And today they did those things. So I think getting them to believe in some of the adjustments we're asking them to make and then also defensively, you know, just tightening everything up. We're definitely hoping to keep the energy up and making sure we're not making any errors or anything like that and really just hounding in and making sure we're all ready and all juiced up, ready to go in the playoffs. From the North Bethlehem Fields, I'm Mike Ventola with the Service Electric Network.